Thank you. Uh, Madam President, Prime Minister Pashinyan, Secretary Blinken, dear Tony. Two months ago, here in Brussels, we hold a partnership council with Armenia. And it was clear that uh, our relations are developing in a positive track, that they are stronger than ever, and that there is a mutual interest to advance them further. And that's what we are doing here today. We are taking this partnership to the next level, together with our American friends, joining forces to demonstrate our strong commitment to Armenia's sovereignty, democracy, and resilience. We want to join our forces to strengthen and move our relations forward in all dimensions. That's what we agreed with the Foreign Minister, Misoyan, to take our Armenia-EU partnership agenda in the highest possible level inside the framework of our partnership concept. And this is not just a word. The President of the Commission has announced a substantial resilience and growth package for Armenia to underpin this partnership agenda. We know that uh, Armenia has to continue working on the reforms in order to increase their resilience. And these efforts will be part of this uh, comprehensive and enhanced partnership agreement. This will increase the resilience of the Armenian society. And we have seen on the run-up to this meeting, we have seen how Armenia is increasingly targeted by foreign information manipulation and interference. And part of our commitment is to support you to tackle this information and to make people understand which is the right way of doing things, improving media literacy. Because we believe that a stronger a more stable Armenia means a stronger, a more stable South Caucasus. Our work will be on the benefit of all countries in the region. Thank you. Thank you very much. May I invite you now to